My name's Baby J. I'm teaching Shelby how to flow. Got that and more coming up in the show. So we'll show while we watching. Best show around. Channel, Channel 1 News starts right, right now. Wow, I didn't know Shelby had a secret talent. Maybe she can take over for Flow Cab one week. We'll be hearing more from Shelby and rapper Baby J later in the show. We've been bringing you stories all month about bullying. And in today's Glory Road, we introduce you to a musician who takes his message seriously. He wants music lovers to stop and think about the lyrics that are coming through their speakers. Here's Shelby Holiday with the story. He's got the look, the sound, the moves, and an important message. So you are not like the average rapper. No. <laughs> what do you rap about? Well, whenever I rap, I rap about staying positive, staying focused, saying no to drugs, anti-bullying. Um, mostly, all my messages, I try to get something, get a message across. That's rapper Baby J more than three years ago in his anti-bullying music video, Don't Laugh At Me. The song helped Baby J jumpstart his music career, setting the stage for nine music tours across the country, with more to come. On tour, Baby J performs at schools, delivering his positive message directly to students. Why is the message of respect important to you? I think kids need to know how important respect is because they hear respect and they're like, you know, I'm going through a lot of problems at home, I don't need to respect nobody. You're not my mom, you're not my dad. Or, Friends sometimes don't respect each other, but they need to know how important it is. And if you don't have respect for yourself, how can you respect others? And that's how you should look at it, and that's how I look at it, because i got to respect everybody. <laughs> and Baby J knows a thing or two about respect. He's been fighting for it since he was just a little kid. So what are some of the challenges you faced growing up? Well, my childhood was tough because growing up, my brothers were in prison and I had no one to talk to. My parents were divorced and it was really hard. And that's the reason why I started rapping because, I mean, I was really hurt, but I needed to show my parents that I want to do something good, not be like my brothers. Unlike his brothers, Baby J avoided trouble, spending most of his time honing his rap skills, dancing, and keeping up with his schoolwork. His hard work finally paid off in May 2009, when he became the first person in his family to graduate high school. But he didn't stop there. Baby J is also the first one in his family to go to college. So each time you have a victory, whether you're graduating or you're performing, does it sort of act as fuel for the next victory yes. down the road? Yes, it does, because it shows that I'm actually accomplishing my goal. You know, just whenever I told myself I want to finish high school, I told myself, I kept telling myself, I can do it, I can do it. And it was, it was hard, but, you know, I told myself, and I, did, I accomplished it. All right, so we're here at Baby J's old high school, Galena Park High School, and even though he recently graduated, he's still a positive influence on many of the students here. A lot of music, it tells people what to do. You don't see it, but it does. And his music, it pushes you in a good way, in a good influence and everything. It, like, basically tells me to stay positive throughout everything. You know, always be yourself and, you know, stay positive and never change what you love to do for anything, you know, just keep following the dream and just keep going. Good advice for his fans and himself. Baby J is chasing his dream and making a ton of progress along the way. He's already performed with artists like Raven Simone, Twista, Omarion, and Soulja Boy. He received a World Peace Award from legendary folk singer Peter Yarrow and became the first rapper honored with a key to the city of Houston. But at the end of the day, Baby J's positive message and the effect it has on his fans is what's most important. I can't leave them hanging, you know, I want to be there for them, not only as a, as a, not only like my fan, but as a friend, you know what I'm saying, because they're supporting me and I want to support them just the same way. Shelby Holiday, Channel One News. Some day, we'll have perfect things. <laughs> and if you want to see some of Baby J's breakdancing skills, bust a move over to ChannelOne.com for some awesome behind the scenes video. Well, that about wraps things up for us today. I'm Adriana Diaz, and we'll see you right back here tomorrow. Pretend that you are there.